Anybody here doing anything fun? Anybody here pegging, getting pegged? Yeah, we got, how's it going? Who got, who's getting pegged? You are, buddy? No? Oh, just your friends? Your friends making fun of you? Okay. Nobody? Come on, Austin. Yeah, back there. When's the last time you got pegged, pal? Early 20s. Early 20s? Okay, what, well, now what are we doing? What is... <laughs> the last time you were pegged was your early 20s? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Only time. Only time. Okay, cool. <laughs> from the raft, the Phantom of the Opera is telling us. <laughs> he swooped in to save this dying crowd work. <laughs> the Phantom of Getting Pegged is here to say. When I was in my 20s, I got pegged one time. <laughs> nice, one time. What happened there? Were you in a relationship? It was a poly thing. It was a poly thing. Ooh, you were, are you still poly? You worked at a health food store? <laughs> so no. <laughs> You're like, you know how it is. You start eating alfalfa. Start getting into green juices. The butcher pegs you. You know, just health food store stuff. <laughs> That's awesome. Did you have any idea that that job was going to open up your sexual horizons when you got it? Your corporate... <laughs> Wow, dude. Look, look what capital, capitalism stole the dildo right out of that man's ass. <laughs> it's disgusting what they're doing to us. <laughs> That's fun, dude. You ever think you're going to get back in the mix? Get that in the zone? You ever get pegged again, you think? You're open to anything? <laughs> all right, damn, all right. I sense, a, I sense a midlife crisis suit coming up. I sense you're going to be going dildo shopping within the decade. <laughs> <laughs>